QuickBird was a high-resolution commercial Earth observation satellite, owned by DigitalGlobe launched in 2001 and decayed in 2015. It was the first satellite in a constellation of three scheduled to be in orbit by 2008. QuickBird used Ball Aerospace's Global Imaging System 2000, BGIS 2000. The satellite collected panchromatic black and white imagery at 61 cm resolution and multispectral imagery at 2.44 at 450 km to 1.63 m at 300 km resolution. As orbit altitude is lowered during the end of mission life, at this resolution, details such as buildings and other infrastructure are easily visible. However, this resolution is insufficient for working with smaller objects such as a license plate on a car. The imagery can be imported into remote sensing image processing software, as well as into GIS packages for analysis. Contractors include Ball Aerospace and Technologies, Kodak and Fokker Space. Topic. QuickBird I. The first QuickBird was launched in November 2000, by Earthwatch from the Pulsetsk Cosmodrome in Russia. QB-1 failed to reach planned orbit and was declared a failure. Prior to QuickBird I and II, DigitalGlobe launched the early Bird 1 successfully in 1997 but the satellite lost communications after only four days in orbit due to power system failure. Topic. QuickBird 2 QuickBird 2, also QuickBird 2 or QuickBird 2, was launched October 18, 2001 from the Vandenberg Air Force Base, California, aboard a Boeing Delta II rocket. The satellite was initially expected to collect at 1 meter resolution but after a license was granted in 2000 by the U.S. Department of Commerce, NASA, DigitalGlobe was able launch the QuickBird 2 with 0.61 meter panchromatic and 2.4 meter multispectral, previously planned 4 meter, resolution. Topic. Mission extension. In April 2011, the QuickBird satellite was raised from an orbit of 450 kilometers (280 miles) to 482 kilometers (300 miles). The process, started in March 2011, extended the satellite's life. Before the operation, the useful life of QuickBird was expected to drop off around mid-2012, but after the successful mission, the new orbit prolonged the satellite life into early 2015. Topic: Decaying. The last picture was acquired on December 17, 2014. On January 27, 2015 QuickBird re-entered Earth's atmosphere. Topic. Specifications Sensors 60 cm, 24 in, 1.37 mu rad, panchromatic at nadir, 2.4 meters, 7 feet 10 in, 5.47 mu rad, multispectral at nadir. MS channels: blue, 450 to 520 nanometers; green, 520 to 600 nanometers; red, 630 to 690 nanometers; near IR, 760 to 890 nanometers. Swath width and area size: nominal swath width, 18 kilometers at nadir. Accessible ground swath, 544 kilometers centered on the satellite ground track, to 30 degrees off nadir. Area of interest. Single area, 18 kilometers by 18 kilometers. Strip, 18 kilometers by 360 k morbid. Altitude, original, 450 kilometers 97.2 degree sun synchronous circular orbit. 
altitude, post-orbit modification, 482 km 98 degree sun synchronous inclination, revisit frequency, 1 to 3.5 days depending on latitude at 60 cm resolution, viewing angle, agile spacecraft, in track and cross-track pointing, period 94.2 minutes in board storage, 128 gigabit capacity approximately 57 single area images spacecraft fueled for 7 years 2100 pounds 950 kilograms 3 04m 10 feet in length topic launch Launch date, October 18, 2001 Launch window, 1851-1906 GMT 1451-1506 EDT Launch vehicle, Delta II Launch site, SLC-2W, Vandenberg Air Force Base, California USAF designation, Quickbird II Topic. See also 2000 in spaceflight 2001 in spaceflight Digital globe